Welcome to Mumbai, 47. One of the most... I'm sure you might very driving class, you duffer. Our intel suggests the Maelstrom is hiding somewhere in the city slums. I've marked the headquarters of the crows on your map. His barbershop is open again. He is an excellent source of information, and I want to make sure he understands who he's working for now. Signal me at once when the shop is open. That is all. Any idea why the boss wants to know when the barbershop is open again? Yeah. Saga, the barber, has a side business dealing in information. He basically has every snitch in the slum sharing the news with him. Boss wants him on our side. Barbie even came down to the hideout to be shown a picture of the boss so he'd recognize him when meeting him. Yeah, all the secrecy is so strange. You know the... Boss, he says having a secret identity. Got some weird ass noises coming from somewhere around here. Better go and see what's up. I'll be in touch. Beautiful man. Delving straight into the heart of darkness, 47. Good luck. This is the third time you're asking me this question. What's wrong with you? Nothing's wrong with me, okay? I just want to make sure I don't mess up when the boss asks me to do something. Shit, relax. Yes, you grab the powder. Into the furnace, lots of smoke goes up. Whatever happens after that isn't your concern. Okay, good. I wonder what does happen after the smoke goes up. Not your concern. Fine. Are so much lana. I mean, why would you watch a movie without dancing? Wait a minute. This is good. This is this is good. This little indiscretion is really a cry for help because. Uh, and a note addressed to Sagar the Barber.
This looks like a very recent picture of the Maelstrom. With this in hand, picking him out in a crowd should be possible. You could also investigate the barber shop and see what is going on there. We showed that picture to the barber? Yeah. He was literally about to shit himself when we brought him down here. Forty-seven? That man there. He resembles the Maelstrom. Try to get close to him for a visual ID. Papi, what are you doing? You need to open the shop. There are people waiting outside already. I, I, I can't remember what he looks like. The guy the crows wanted me to provide information to, you know. Their boss. They showed me his picture in their hideout two days ago. I was so stressed out. I thought they were going to kill me or something. I, I can't remember his face. What if he shows up and, and, I, and I miss him? Then you should go and explain it to them. They probably still have the picture there. But what if they hurt me? What will happen to you? Or if they decide to burn? Down the shop like they did with that other guy with the metal recycling. I won't do it. Pave, I told you we would get into trouble with the snitching business. But you had to go and earn some easy money sharing information with the gangs. This is your mess. You fix it. Right, 47. We're open for business. Yes, finally. We know what the no maelstrom looks like and expect to him to show up. Thank you. Patience and shaving cream is what's on the menu now, 47. Bicep, bicep. I'm afraid I'm like a little bit shame. Shame. Not the maelstrom. I'm sorry, sir. Not right now. Ah, Chalobai. Maybe next time then. Hey, any chance for a shave today? 
No luck. I'm afraid not, sir. Forget this. I'll go somewhere else. Forty-seven. That man by the counter. That's the maelstrom. Well, looks like our patience paid off. Hello. Come How on about in. you invite him in Thank for you, a close shave? All right, I'm ready for my shave. Make it a close one. The tides are changing, my friend. Can you feel it in the air? My bones are creaking with joy at the prospect of what is about to happen. I don't feel anything, I'm afraid. You... The infamous Maelstrom is dead. Very well done, 47. No rest for the wicked, however. On to the next one.